So what are you going to do now? There's a project waiting for me, shooting in Naples. I'd like you to come with me. I mean, it would be incredible. But how can I say yes to Nelson when I still have feelings for Remy? Do you still feel like there's a future with Remy? Oh, whether there is or isn't, he's always on my mind. I can't go with you. I get him. Get him away. No, you have been out of control this week. Eden, let me go. Not until you tell me what is going on with you. You know what's going on. I'm missing something. Does this really all have to do with Stevie? Eden, I just saw Brie all over a new boyfriend. It's not exactly news. No, I guess not. But a few days ago, she was kissing me. You and Brie need to sort out whatever it is this thing is between you. There's nothing to sort out. Strongly disagree. Never gets old. And you've been saying that for a long time. Oh, watch it. Leah get away all right? Yeah, she got away with enough time to get to the clinic. Is it okay, though? Oh, yeah, it's just a check-in, man. She's just staying on top of things, you know? You hungry? Yeah, starving. Hey, Bree. Hey. How you going? Uh, not bad. Not bad. I bet it's nice to have the beach back to yourselves. Yeah, I haven't seen much of the film crew around. Oh, that's because they've packed up in there. Well, that was fast. So that's it then. The movie's done. Yeah. Yeah, I guess some things just aren't meant to be. Listen, you want to um, join us for coffee? Uh, yeah. Yeah, actually, that sounds really good. Yeah. Hey, Hey. Hi. We were just grabbing a bite to eat. We'll meet you up there? Yeah, I might catch you guys later. That looks complicated. Have you got time to talk? What happened then? Giving each other space. Yeah, it's important. Just tell me how angry do you think Irene's going to be? Mask, could you just relax? I mean, I really reckon you're over... Oh. Oh, I see. Yeah. Uh, don't sorry, what on earth were you thinking ordering this much food? Well, I was trying to show initiative. That's a lot of initiative. Well, yeah, we had so many extra customers with the movie people. I thought I'd just order extra and step it up so we could cope with the demand, you know? Yeah. And now there's no film and no crew and no fans. Which is not just about the money, Ru, it's about the waste. So I need to move this in the next couple of days or the diner's gonna take a huge hit. Hello. Hey, welcome home. Thanks, love. It's great to be home. There's someone I'd like you to meet. Harper, this is Bronte. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. You too. Bronte's going to be staying with us for a couple of days. Oh, sure. I probably should have rung ahead, but it was a bit of a last-minute decision, wasn't it, Dal? <laughs> so are you Irene's daughter? Uh, no, I'm <laughs> just her housemate. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Well, I hope it's okay that I'm here. I don't want to put anyone out. Don't be silly. You're not putting anyone out, love. Make yourself at home. I'll pop the kettle on. It's a lovely house. Thank you. Come on upstairs. I'll show you your room. Make sure you put the hamburgers on there. Yeah, and the salads. I need to put all the salads as mm -hmm. well. Yeah. Well, maybe we can throw some cutlery in and maybe a couple of free chairs. Hey! Mm -hmm. Egg and bacon roll, please, Maz. Oh, right, how about a hamburger? I've got a good deal on a hamburger today. Usually you're trying to get us to eat less meat. You know, what's with all the deals all of a sudden? Uh, well, Maz may have ordered a lot of extra food, hoping business to be booming during filming. Ah, uh, bad timing. Yeah, and I don't want it to go to waste, especially not the fancy burgers. You know, they cost a lot of money. Well, can't you just freeze them? Ah, uh, the freezer's full. And we've got all the lovely burger buns and the salads and everything. I need to move all that before Irene gets back. How much meat are we talking about? Oh, we probably need the whole town in here to clear it. So no biggie then. Why don't we have a community barbecue down at the beach? It'll be fun. We could use the surf club's barbie. That is such a great idea. Justin, you're a genius. Ah. Can you help us? Yeah, sure. We've got nothing planned, eh? Yeah, drag me into this. <laughs> Thank you. Can you do it today? Yeah, sure. Come on, let's get yeah. moving. All right. Oh. All right, thanks, guys. And Justin? Irene's not my only boss. Don't worry. If Irene doesn't find out, neither will they. Thank you. Rob.
right, I probably don't have a right to ask this. You can ask me anything. And I know that we agreed to keep our distance. Your idea, not mine. <laughs> just, I'm a little confused. Um, I, I just saw you with Nelson. And it threw me, uh, because only a few days ago you and I were having a moment, and now I see you with Nelson. Maybe. It's a, what, are you playing games? What you saw was Nelson and I saying goodbye. He's gone. Where? Italy. He asked me to go with him. I said no. But isn't that what you've always wanted? Go see the world? It is. Right, so what are you still doing here? Because I don't want to see the world with Nelson. I want to see it with you. I want us to get back together. Right over here, mate. Yeah. OK, so we'll just give this a scrub and set it up down on the beach. Good idea. You want me to grab the supplies from Marilyn? Yeah, can you grab coffees as well? Of course. OK, hang on, hang on. I think we need to come up with a game plan. OK, so I'm going to print up some posters with the prices on them. Good call. Maybe a two-for-one offer, you know, to get people excited. OK. You be on the burgers, you do the salads and the sauces, and I will do the serving. OK, let's do it. <laughs> Don't look now, but you'll be coming your dad. Oh, I'm going to take that as a compliment. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Where is this coming from? I'm sorry, I put you on the spot. I shouldn't have done that. But, but first, you break up with me, and you move on with someone else. And all of a sudden, you want to get back together. OK, I know. It sounds like I'm all over the place. Yeah, you think? But I've been feeling like this for a long time now. About you, us. I love you, Remy. And that's why I couldn't go away with Nelson, because I want to be with you. What do you expect me to say to that? I don't know. That I'm glad you'd stay, that you didn't ride off in the sunset with some other boat. Like Maybe. exactly what I needed, thank you. So were you two old friends, or...? We literally just met in the hospital. Really? Irene saw me in the waiting room. I was um, in a bit of a state. Yeah, well, you had every right to be. Next thing I know, I'm pouring my heart out to a complete stranger. <laughs> but um, she was so kind and generous. Really came to my rescue. Sounds like Irene. Yeah. Well, what about you two? How did you meet? Not too differently, actually. Irene took my sister and I in when we needed it. She really had our backs. Wow. And I'm obviously very lucky to have crossed paths with you. And the feeling is mutual, love. Mm. Oh, but love, I'm, I'm sorry. We're yapping on here. You must be exhausted. A bit, yeah. <laughs> Um, would it be okay if I grabbed a shower? Of course, love. There's fresh towels on your bed. Thank you. It was really good to meet you. Likewise. Love, I'm sorry I didn't ring ahead, but um, you know, it was a last minute decision. Yeah, it's fine. Is she okay? No, love, she's not. She's very ill. She has been for a while. I'm sorry to hear that. Some sort of autoimmune disease. She's gone through it by herself. How awful. Yeah. Which is why I thought a couple of days in the sunshine by the sea might do us some good. I'm sure it will. I just remember how scary it is when you're waiting on test results. She needs support around her. Absolutely. Thank you. Hey, Rem. You right? I need a drink. I'll take that as a no. What's up? She wants to get back together. What? Bree. She wants us to be together again. Well, what about that Nelson guy? Oh, she ended that, apparently. I did not see that coming. That oh, makes two of us. Okay, so what does this mean for you both? Three's all over the place. 
can't keep up. How do I know that she's not going to change her mind again? What do you want? I don't know. This is the woman that you love, right? Hey, it's not that simple. Actually, it kind of is. And this is my second home. Harry, this is amazing. <laughs> this is all yours. Ah, uh, no, not quite. Um, I co-own it with my friend Leah. You guys must be really proud. Yeah, it's hard work, but we love it. Mind you, it has made a lot easier working with dear friends. Oh. Marilyn, this is Bronte. Oh, Bronte. Hi, I'm Marilyn. <laughs> We just did this. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> nice to meet you. Oh, likewise, likewise. So, how did everything go with your health check? Yes. Yeah. Oh, good, good. Wonderful, Wonderful news. Look, I'm, I'm sorry if I left you in the lurch. I hear things were pretty eventful while I was gone. Oh, yes, well, eventful is a good word for it, yes. <laughs> how is everyone? Oh, I just think they're all trying to come to terms with it, really. And, and how have you been coping on your own with Leah out of the picture? Oh! Yes, you know, in the film people are gone now, so everything's back to normal, business as usual. <laughs> anyway, I'd better get back to it, but um, lovely to meet you, Bronte. You yeah. Okay, girly. Whatever you want, it's on the house. Sorry. Sorry, I know I said I was hungry, but now I'm not really up to eating. Oh, love them. Is there anything I can do? Nah, I think it's just the stress of waiting for my results. I get it. You're in limbo. It's horrible. It's really nice to talk to someone who gets it. Yeah, doing this alone would be hell. Love, I'm here, OK? You just let me know how I can help you. Uh, I might go for a walk, actually. That sounds like a great idea. Irene, Thank you. She's got her own house and a business. Yeah, it's packed with customers. Well, there is a partner, Leah, someone. Trust me, she's a total pushover. Firing up the Barbie pretty soon, if you're sticking around. Oh, I'm good, thanks. You all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Actually, I'm not, but nobody is right now. And you're busy, so don't, don't worry about it. No, 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 no. You know, it's been a tough time, but I'm around if you want to talk. It's Remy. Not easy moving on. It's him. Uh, hi. Sure, sure. Uh, where did you want to meet? Come in. Remy, I'm really sorry. I know that was a lot for you to hear, and I get that. No, no, you... it was just a surprise. I uh, needed a minute to figure things out. And have you? Bree, it's always been you. You know that, right? Okay, you are everything to me. And you're everything to me. Do you remember when you needed some time before you could truly commit to us? Mm -hmm. I think that's what I need right now. Okay. Because I just do not want to screw this up. Do you really think you would? Well, a lot's happened since we were together. And I haven't really dealt with any of that. And I know that I can't ask you to wait. I can wait. But if we're meant to be together, we will be. When we're ready. Okay, there you go. Thank you. 
Hey, this was such a great idea. Maz is a lucky girl. Happy to help, Ru. Yeah, maybe we should make this a regular thing. Yeah, I think so too. So you'd be all right to volunteer next time? <laughs> Two burgers with a lot. There you go. Thank you. Hey. Hey. This is such a cool idea, an old school community barbecue. Yeah, and isn't it good seeing people back at the beach? Yeah, for sure. Apparently we know how to save the day. Yes, we <laughs> do, so keep them coming. Hey. Hey. Are you going to grab one? No, I wish. The doctors aren't big on me eating anything unhealthy. But um, this looks cool. Is this a fundraiser or something? Oh, not exactly. They're just helping move excess stock from the diner. Oh, it's nice of them. Yeah, that's just what Summer Bay is like. If someone's struggling, then the community really steps up. I'm not surprised, considering Irina's from here. It's a beautiful place. Have you heard anything about your results yet? You know, the weight is killing me. Uh, but all I can do is focus on the positive. You know, meeting Irene and you. It's been amazing. I'm so sorry that you're going through this. Yeah. You don't realise how important your health is until you don't have it anymore. Oh, Nothing. Marilyn, what's this about? Uh, sorry? This this invoice. Where's all the stock? Okay, um, promise me you won't get mad. When do I ever get mad? I may have over-ordered a little bit. A little bit? Yeah, well, I tried to take the initiative and order lots of extra stock for the film crew people. God save us, they must eat an awful lot. Yeah, they did. A lot. And then they all left. Well, then where's the food that you ordered? Ah, uh, well, it's OK, um, because we've worked out a way to use it all up. We're having a barbecue at the surf club. <laughs> it's, it's up there now. <laughs> Who's we? But Justin and Rue and Theo. Uh, it's, apparently it's going really well, so we're not going to lose any more money. And, It'll never happen again, Irene, I promise. OK, it's all right. There's no need to panic. I wasn't panicking. <laughs> no, I was actually, yeah. Love, it's all right. Just please, next time, tell me. I will. Thank you. If there's one thing the last week has taught me, it's not to sweat the small stuff. Thank you, Irene. Mm. <sighs> oh, love, are you all right? Come sit down. I'm so sorry to keep doing this. What's happened? Did you get the results back? Yeah, it's bad. It's really bad. Oh, sweet. They said that there's nothing more that they can do. I mean, I'm gonna die. Put the barbie away. Let me give you a hand with this. Righto, thanks. Today felt good. Yeah, even though I was expecting a day off. Well, just be thankful that I'm your boss and not Rue. Very yeah, good point. And don't let her catch you thinking about surf until we finish packing up here. What's that? Must have come in with the tide. From where? All right, this just got weirder. Uh, hang on, I'm not done yet. What's with all this stuff? I guess that explains why I've been feeling so much worse. Devastating up. I asked how long I had, and they said probably you know, six months. I can't believe it. I've always been so health conscious. I watch what I eat, I don't smoke. It's, 
It's so damn unfair. I shouldn't complain. I've I've had a great life. It's just it's so much more I want to do. <laughs> yeah. Of course there is. I guess that's the challenge, right? See how much I can fit into the next six months. Um, I should get out of your hair. This is the last thing that you need. No, no. You stay right where you are. I am going to make us a nice cup of tea. Irene, seriously. You've only just met me. This is my bad news, not yours. Bronte, you are exactly where you need to be. And you are welcome to stay here for as long as you need. No. I mean it. I mean it, Dallas. You're not alone. And it feels like we're finally free to get a fresh start. You know what? What? We deserve it. Okay. Uh, I could not be better. Really? Then why all of a sudden does it feel like you're a million miles away? Yeah, I just got your texts. 